tried to look up at the stars and realized that you can't see them? Or looked down a street at night and noticed that the light emitted was blinding? If you say yes to either of these questions, no, you're not alone. Because in America, 99% of Americans agree, saying that they can't see the stars from where they live. Hi, my name is Lily, and I'm here to tell you about all the negative aspects of light pollution and help you to find a better alternative. Whether or not you know it, your everyday patterns have been changed because of the bright LEDs or light-emitting diodes currently used in house and street lights. Because almost all of the countries worldwide have made this switch, human eyesight has been drastically getting worse. The glare that is emitted disrupts your retina and can cause harm. Rates are also rising in the number of cases of cancer since we made this switch. Light pollution is, can have very severe effects on society and many people don't realize this. It's where so much man-made light is emitted into the night sky. It can disrupt some natural cycles and it makes it very difficult for people to observe the stars. So here's my proposed idea, a new type of light bulb, the Safe Energy. This is a light bulb that works similar to an LED light, but it has a red film around the bulb. It would glow to produce light. This would make your eyes be better able to adjust to the surrounding tones and running completely off of the idea of plant power. Chloroplasts create the energy for plants to survive. And if we're able to harness this force, we might be able to create a new type of light. We could start by separating the chloroplasts from plants and then adding a chemical formula to it. This combination would be of yeast and water, and we could use the chemical reaction present to power a light bulb. Why wouldn't you want to help save so many people? Each year, people are dying due to cancer and they're losing their eyesight. The Safe Energy product will do a great number and can help so many people in the future. Now you and I can look up to the stars in peace.